Hey everyone and welcome to my channel. Today I will be unboxing the Target Beauty Box for August 2018. I'm probably one of the last people to be unboxing this because I didn't order it when it first came out. I watched a couple unboxings and realized that one of the items in here um, did something a little bit different than I thought it did. And so I was like, oh, let me just go ahead and subscribe so I can try that out. Um, so the Target Beauty Box is $7 a month typically, though they do vary some months. It's not a subscription box because you do have to go in to the Target website and purchase it every month. I believe it's like the first Monday or second Monday of the month they post them. Um, so it is kind of nice because if you don't feel like you'll use the products, you don't have to spend it and then, you know, it's a little bit easier sometimes, though they do sell out quickly, especially the good ones. So without further ado, I will go ahead and get into the box. So when you open it up, and I know a lot of people's have come damaged because some of the items have spilled and gotten the box wet, but I'm crossing my fingers because everything looks good so far. So on top you have the car, which says Hello Summer Stunner. On the back, it lists the items as well as a $3 off coupon of a purchase of $15 or more. And then when you open the tissue box, uh, tissue box, tissue paper, there are all uh, the products. So I will start with a product that made me go ahead and go out and purchase this because the box hadn't um, sold out yet. So that is the Intuition Fab Sh Razor by Schick. Um, so this has a total of five blades. Um, and that's why I didn't subscribe first because I was like, oh, if it's like a three blade razor, I don't really want it. But this is a five blade blazer and you can shave in both directions. And that's why I went ahead and purchased this box. I'm not sure how much this retails for. I wonder if it says. And also I apologize about the sirens. I live in the city. Um, no, it doesn't say the value, but I'm sure that this was more than $7. So I'm excited to try it out uh, and be able to shave both ways. I'm probably gonna be really nervous when I do that because I'm just not used to doing that. But this is why I subscribed to the box or, or bought this box. So all the other stuff is basically free after this for me, but for you, if that's not really your thing, then maybe you see it differently. All right, the next thing is Not Your Mother's Beach Babe Soft Wave Sea Salt Spray in Tropical Banana. So I have this size of the regular sea salt spray. I don't really use sea salt spray because my hair is just, it's its straight. So sea salt spray doesn't really do anything for me except for my hair, make my hair uncomfortable. I know I can like braid my hair and spray it in it and have it wavy, but I just haven't had luck with it. Um, but I love banana scented things. So let me go ahead and see. I just want to lift this up and Okay, it smells like a tropical sunscreen, basically. But anyway, um, that's good to have around, and maybe I'll just spray it in my hair so that it's, I smell like tropical bananas. <laughs> the next item I'm pulling out is Simple Cleansing Wipes, and it says it removes waterproof mascara, and it's a total of seven wipes. I always like to have makeup wipes, um, makeup remover wipes around. Now, I personally don't use makeup remover wipes to take off my actual makeup from my face. I use Pons and then baby wipes to get that off to I just don't like the oils on them on my face because I have oily skin, it just makes me break out. But I do use these when I apply my foundation. Sometimes I apply it with my fingers and I'll wipe my fingers off on these afterwards, which is not what you're supposed to do, but it's what I do, so whatever. <laughs> All right, next I'm seeing a product from Acure. It's the Brilliant, Brilliantly Brightening Day Cream. Um, we got a scrub from Acure last month that I really liked. Um, I don't really use day creams because I have oily skin. I do put moisturizer on before I put my makeup on, but I make sure it's a very watery light one, and day creams tend to not be a consistency that really works. I may try this one out, or I might give it to my mom because she does, she'd probably like something like this. Then I'm seeing a tiny little bottle from Bliss. It's their Fab Foaming 2-in-1 Cleanser and Exfoliator with Bamboo Buffers. So it's basically a face wash. I love skincare, so I'm super excited to try this out, and it's a really nice small size. It's good for travel. The only problem with it is that it's a twist top, not, um, smells nice. Um, not one of those bottles where you can push the thing open and get a small amount out. So I think the product might be kind of hard to get out, especially once you get to the bottom, because if you're traveling, you can't necessarily have it bottom, uh, top side down the whole time, maybe while you're traveling. So that may be a little bit difficult. And the last item in the box, whoo, which was a little bit unscrewed, uh, I know a lot of people, their sea salt spray opened and completely destroyed the box, and their lotion opened and some of it got in the box, but thankfully mine was loose, but did not get anywhere. So this is Eden Body Works Skin, Body Lotion, Coconut Shea, and Vitamin E. Give it a smell, I'm sure it smells just like coconut. 
Ooh, it does. That smells like summer. I'm um, excited to try this out, though we are kind of at the end of summer today. It is like 75 degrees where I live, and I'm so excited. Fall is my favorite season, and it finally feels like fall, so I'm really excited. So I don't know if coconut and banana are really calling to me right now. I want to smell apple pie and, um, I don't know, pumpkin and spice and all those fun smells. So anyway, for $7, I think this is great, especially seeing that you got we got this razor. I will try this out probably this weekend. Um, very excited to try that out. Um, if you're into uh, unboxing videos, I post a lot of different unboxing videos, not just beauty boxes, food boxes, bath boxes, um, the whole nine yards. So if you're into stuff like that, go ahead and subscribe. And if you enjoyed this unboxing, go ahead and give it a thumbs up, and I will see you in my next video.